would you go into Mexico, Los Algodones, for dental work during the pandemic? So, uh, will I still be able to get a margarita later? We are south, way far south. The sunniest city in the country, the world? Yeah. Well, <laughs> so far south that we are going across the border right into Mexico. We were here a few years ago. We both got dental work done. Prior to COVID, we're gonna show you some of that footage because I'm not gonna get as much detail this time. Ask yourself this question. Would you go to Los Algodones, the dental capital of the world during the pandemic for dental care? <laughs> I'm Tom. And I'm Sheree. And this is EnjoyTheJourney.life Mexico Dental. <laughs> <laughs> from the border at Los Algodones, Mexico. Still on the US side. Cherie has raced across to her dental appointment. Yeah, we're back and this time it's during the pandemic. So we are back in Los Algodones, Mexico for dental work. So some of the most popular ones are not necessarily the cheapest or the best. They've just been doing it a lot longer. And we've had one dentist that keeps getting keeps, recommended. Yeah. They've got like the best reviews on Google. I actually can't find any a negative, negative review. reviews. And then when I called, I actually found out that their prices were cheaper than everybody else that we have talked to. And we're going to Dr. Abdul Inuez. Hopefully I got the pronunciation correct on that one. And so it's about time for our appointment. Yep, we better, we better uh, get going. Get rolling here. So I am thankful I don't have any dental work to do. I had a clean checkup this last year. Ask yourself this question, would you go into Mexico, uh, Los Algodones for dental work during the pandemic? Well, that's what we're doing today, or at least Shree is doing. Finishing getting a cap on a tooth. So time to mask up and head across the border. How much business do you guys do? Sometimes they could sell up to 8,000 a day in this pharmacy. 8,000 US? Yep. Okay. A lot of people come in here. Okay, well you got the prime spot here, right? Yep. <laughs> So, uh, your resident then? Yeah. Okay, you mind if I record you? No, sir! <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Who do you work for? Castle Dental. Castle Dental, okay. So how has business been uh, since the pandemic? Business has been very slow, but thanks to the internet and thanks to social media, we have been moving good steadily. That's awesome, uh, so things are picking up then? Things are picking up slowly but surely. We have, uh, we have a clientele basis from 10 years back. They still keep coming back. If you guys want to look at our reviews on castledental.com, check out the reviews and you will see that everyone here is a satisfied customer. Awesome. That, that's great to hear. We love coming here. Well, good luck and hope business keeps picking up yes, for you. Okay, guys. Take care. You too. This is for YouTube, so. For YouTube. <laughs> yeah. So you guys. I'm a right here. Okay, you own the pharmacy then, yes. right? 
I'm waiting for you, customer, Mary's Pharmacy. We have the best prices in town, okay? Okay. Don't body can be my prices. We <laughs> okay. can beat any price in town. Okay. Good price, good service, and good quality. So okay? don't just necessarily stop at the purple place right when you come in, no, huh? No. <laughs> okay. Don't body can be my prices. <laughs> Okay. Remember, no Viagra, no coochie coochie. <laughs> I told you. <laughs> Thank you. That's something that is really awesome down here is most people aren't afraid to be on camera. They enjoy it. They like to have fun with the camera. So it's awesome to uh, find some of the locals that want to talk about their business or just joke and be funny. <laughs> I am going on memory about where our clinic is Dr. Abdul Ruiz, I believe, is right over here. Oh, there it is. <laughs> I remembered it right here. I think there's a lot of great dental places around here. This is definitely highly rated. I hear there's a few you should stay away from, so I guess, if anything, do your research. But they do everything. They built her crown overnight, so they've got the whole lab in the back or whatever and the border is right there <laughs> the parking area is right on the other side of that correction dr abdul inuez if i'm saying that right and he has a whole bunch of other dentists that work with him and actually sheree said she's like favorite dentist is the person that's working on her now so very gentle which is nice when it comes to a dentist <laughs> Here. Oh, yay! He's probably gonna come in with a camera. See? Look. Look. <laughs> no, you, you couldn't imagine that. <laughs> I told him we were gonna be recording and we're gonna do a video on these guys. <laughs> <laughs> they are awesome. Sweet. Yeah. He's gonna watch us on YouTube. Cool. The dental video. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. You can call. <laughs> Does it fit? Not yet. It will. It's feeling better and better as he works with it. Yeah, I remember that uh, when I got mine. Yeah, you got one here too, didn't you? Oh, yeah. Your turn. Okay. All right. Your turn. Are you scared? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, uh, will I still be able to get a margarita later? Oh, probably it's a good idea before to, oh. to get it now. <laughs> oh, he's doing the impression. Yes. Oh. That's so exciting. Yeah, cool. All right. Last time in the chair for a while. Yay, I get crowns. Should I be excited? Is there a crown up here? <laughs> Getting the small details. Right. Yeah. Close, really. Open. Bye. Open. Okay. The paper give me the point where where is high stuff. Right. Yeah, I remember that. You bite on the. It, what kind of paper is it? By occlusion. Okay. By occlusion. This is the man, Doctor Abdul Inuez, right? Yes. Very good. How about you? Excellent. Working hard. That's good. So, how has the pandemic affected business? In the beginning, so much. Right now, it's affecting too. But we are working with about 30% of the patients. Okay. And in one regular day in this month, usually we see about 30 to 40 patients a day. Now we are looking just 12 because uh, after any patient, we need to clean, disinfect, wait. It's not possible to uh, see another patient in the middle in the More same natural. room. It's very important to don't have so much patients in the, in the lobby. Yeah, that's really good. And mm -hmm. the Canadian patients, they can cross the border now. We they are waiting the for border open. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> he will check uh, your x-ray. Okay. See the, the feeding, the color. Yeah. And send to polish. Okay. Okay. It's the final part. All right. It's my turn. Yay. <laughs> uh, all right. And the X-ray, everything looks very good. But Yay. I was checking it. Okay. okay. Bite. All right. It's time to send to the laboratory for the okay. final adjustments. About 30 more minutes 
Okay. And that's it, okay? Great, thank you. Yeah. And you have really good people working here. Oh, yeah, he was much. awesome. I'm like, this is the best dental experience I've ever had. Oh, I yeah. like you here. Thank yeah, you, yeah, Joey. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and just wait in the lobby for okay. 30 minutes and see you later. All right, thank you so much. Oh, very good yeah. to see you again. Great to see you. <laughs> we feature you guys in several videos. I think it's important to show that even with the pandemic, you guys are still up to par or beyond what other dentists are doing to stay safe. Yeah. Yeah. So mm -hmm. yeah, great. and it's still safe and very clean and feel really good about coming no, here. Yeah. Pandemic or no pandemic, we need to clean this in fact eh, before and after. Before, education. right. But, but now, now we need to do it that more. <laughs> Yes, right. but it is safe to come here and the border is still open as of this recording till 2 o'clock. And if yes. anything, it's easier to get in and out because there's less people. There's <laughs> less people. Oh, sure, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Oh, mine's low too. <laughs> right. Well, they say not to because it affects the, a gland in there to do the wrist instead. Good tip to know. Look it up. <laughs> well, that's a little better. Yeah. It's uh, so good. nice and sunny out oh, here. Since, so uh, nice. So how's it going in there? You know what? It is such a great experience here. This is the third time we've been here. What I really like about this culture is they take their time. They are very patient. They're not in, I want to compare it to like to the U.S. where everybody's like on a schedule, on a schedule, in a hurry. All right, get patient through, patient through. They really take their time here and you can feel the difference and their compassion. They're just gentle and it's just been a great experience. We've seen several dentists here at this office and every one of them has been a great experience. Experience. So we recommend Dr. Abdul Inuez. Dr. Inuez actually comes in after the work has been done and double checks everything. And the ones that have done the work have been amazing. So thumbs up. Yeah, well, we're just about done. Yay, one more day here. One more day. Nice. You want honey? How many? <laughs> <laughs> so where do you get the honey? All local honey? Yes. Okay. Oh no, <laughs> YouTube. <laughs> Welcome to Mexico. Thank you. We'll send some people down here. Okay, thank you. <laughs> you bet. Pitcher, yeah. pitcher, for me. Pitcher, pitcher. Yeah. Thank you. You bet. Paparazzi, <laughs> Paparazzi. Mm -hmm. I'm still a little numb. <laughs> we go for authentic Mexican. Ooh, cheers. <laughs> it's the best time I've ever had getting my teeth done. Made in Mexico, not Chinatown. Okay, awesome. <laughs> Getting subscribers. <laughs> 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 What's your name? I'm Ruben. Ruben, Ruben. all right, come and see Ruben. There you go. Come I'm and right see here. Ruben. <laughs> <laughs> Look, you can get a massage here, right on the street. Oh yeah. So if you come down to Sarah Street and you look for the amazing dental care sign, you'll take a left right before that. And we're here. So I don't have to be numbed at all today, right? No, no, no. Perfect. Hey, I think it was hours yesterday. I was like, <laughs> they had good sleep last night, I asked them. <laughs> <laughs> How many hours did you get? Eight hours. Man. Very good. <laughs> there is an, um, another, uh, another option in the, in the street. That's the bad boy right there. That's it. <laughs> it's the only bad boy in my mouth. <laughs> uh -huh. 
Everybody else has been really good. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, stop it. That's enough. <laughs> That's enough. So Get out of my face. If they're doing the laser, you can ask them to take care of a few of the, like, the wrinkles. What are you saying? <laughs> you saying I got wrinkles? Okay, this is for you to sign here. Okay. And these are your receipts. Glad this that's is... not in U.S. <laughs> no, definitely no. <laughs> this is your receipt in dollars, 440 U.S. dollars. And okay. And pencils would be the 8,800 pesos. Okay, gracias. Okay. We just had some dental work done, so we're... Uh... I need a shot of tequila. <laughs> I do need a shot of tequila. <laughs> tequila. <laughs> the border closes at 2 o'clock mountain time and i've got less than two hours right now there's a little bit of a wait i'm gonna hop in line and sheree's gonna have to join me because if you lose the cutoff you spend the night here <laughs> and that's not the plan so it's time to book on over and get in line biggest downside yeah. is having to deal with this. Two years ago, we didn't see anything like It that. wasn't like this. The bar was closed, but they were nice enough to give me a beer to go. And the line's gone down a lot shorter. Now we're talking. Yeah, this is much better. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> approached every couple seconds it seems like they were closed for five months so they're starting we, oh we can certainly sympathize with that yeah we yeah. can sure so he was questioning he asked like well any medication i'm like uh well, i don't think so and it's like well what do you not think so about <laughs> right, well, why so, did you say I don't think so? I told you I got a prescription. Well, I, yeah, I didn't know if it was like serious stuff is, or not worth talking about. Yeah, but if you're not, you, they, you have to declare. You have to be on top of your game. Then, then, then he's like, okay, well, let's take a look at what you got here. How many bottles of tequila? Uh, one. <laughs> <laughs> can I take one? <laughs> yeah, how many can you take? I... <sighs> seems like it was one or two it's not much the whole thing is just so dumb <laughs> and this is our country it's Shave her head. <laughs> Hi. 